Hi, everyone. I uh, just want to introduce you guys all to the new drive. Right now, I'm in the old state. I can tell because I have a create and an upload button. In order to switch over to the new drive, we need to go over to the settings, drop down menu, and click on experience the new drive. From there, you're going to see our user interface change quite a bit. And this will be the standard, excuse me, this will be the standard interface um, going forward with Google when they decide to push this out and force everyone into it. I'm going to start from left to right. Notice that our two buttons have been replaced by one button that says new. When I click on this, I can add a new folder, a new file upload, a new folder upload, and I have my docs along with a more button down here for my other Google Docs, other types of Google Docs. My sharing folder has been replaced with an incoming folder. It has the same function and behaves in the same way, but the name is now changed from sharing to incoming. I also have my recents, my stars, uh, my starred and the trash can or whatever is called bin. Now, as I go across the top and I select a folder, you'll notice that I get a uh, what's called a breadcrumb trail at the top. Um, if I select in this folder, I have some quick things that I can do. I can share this folder, I can move this folder, I can star this folder. I can still change the color of the folder, I can download it and rename it and also throw it in the trash. Over here, I have my option to, instead of seeing it in a list like this, I can switch to the grid view and switch back. I can also sort the items in this folder by last modified, last edited by me, last opened by me, or by name. Over here is my information panel. Uh, that is very similar to what was in the other one. I can see the details of this folder, and I can see the last activity in this folder, and I can get rid of it. Lastly, over here, I have uh, settings. If I click on this, I can also leave the new drive and go back to the old. And this option will be going away very soon. I don't know when it'll go away, because Google doesn't really come out and say too clearly or too definitely. But I'm going to go back to experience the new drive. Also in my settings... Let's see, there it is. Also in my settings, I uh, can click on the settings and I have a new settings panel here. Convert uploads. If I have this checked, it'll convert uploads, uh, uploaded files to their Google Docs counterparts. I like that because I like to have my Word uh, files open up in Google Drive as a Google Doc so I can edit them. And then I can also turn around and share them as a Word Doc. Um, let's see what else. Managing apps. These are other programs that I use to connect and verify through Google. But that's not the most important thing. Um, let's see. Lastly, when working in files, um, I get this sort of interface. This happens to be an image. So up here, I can choose to open it with other Google um, apps compatible third-party programs. I can print it, I can share it, I can download it, and then this is a common symbol for more actions. If I click on this, in this case I can rename it or report abuse. Um, I can get some information on this app, toggle it on and off, and I can pop it out to another tab, and I can actually close it too. If I'm actually in a Google Doc, all right, if I open up a um, standard document, you can see that here it is. Um, if I do highlight it right here, I can drag it around and drop it into any of the folders I would like. Also, on the side here is a disclosure triangle for my drive, and you will see all the folders that I have in my drive. Not only are they in this window, but they're over here. This is nice because I can drill down into folders. Whoops. And I can take my document and drop it into a folder within a folder within a folder within a folder. So 
that's very handy right there. Also, if you notice, this new dock here, when I have it selected, I have a lot of tools up here. Right here, I can get the link so I can share it with people, but also have access to the shared settings. If I click on this, I can then type in the people that I'd like to share it with. Oop, click done. Here, I can also share the document. I get the same sort of uh, uh, window as I do when clicking here. I can also get a preview of the document. I can move it to trash and here are my three vertical lines that means more actions. If I click here I can choose what to open it, open it with. I can move it to another folder. I can add a star, rename it, view the details, make a copy of it and I can choose to download it. So uh, this is probably the neatest thing about the new drive is that I don't have to open a dock to start uh, manipulating it. There you go. I hope you've enjoyed this tour of the new Google Drive.